guys. Darren from Venom Fluid Art. With bubbles. Can't forget the bubbles. I won't let you. No doubt. Play night in the Venom Garage. Play night. I like play nights. Play nights are fun. I uh, see you're rocking one of my flutter buys. I am rocking one of your flutter buys and I've stolen all the neons. So get your sunnies out, guys. Oh my goodness. These are going to be bright. That's my colour palette. Yeah, it is. So we're having a neon night. We are having a party. Sweet. No need for glow sticks. This is going to light everything up, we're hoping. Man, if I'd known we were doing this, I'd have got the black light out. I know, look at this. Cute. And I might even just add a little bit of touch of sparkle. Oh. We'll see how I feel. Okay. All right. So, anything you want to do, just as long as you make this bling alicious. Okie dokie. Yep. That sounds like a plan to me. Now, before we start, though, did you want to have on track, just in case you go for your neon green? Quite possible. All right, I'll stick in there. You never know what I'll spring up with. And I know usually you, you sort of come in accustomed to green a bit more. I'm not really. There's a few you like. There are a couple of greens I do like. There's no longer a pure hate. No. So we may have that one. Brown, on the other hand. Different story. <laughs> mm, you're really not a fan, are you? Nope. All right. The only thing that should be brown is trees. I would have gone with something else, but anyway. Mr. Hanky. Yeah. <laughs> Each to their own, you know. <laughs> Decidedly so. I love this colour. It's lovely, isn't it? It's magical. Look at it. Purple delicious. Really a nice colour. So I just thought, yeah, it's time of it sort of we're going into autumn now in Australia. We are. So we definitely need some colour. <laughs> Before the winter gloom turns up. Yes. So I thought we'll keep it bright and happy. And as I said, you can do whatever floats your boat. Archimedes principle. And, well, that sort of floats everybody's boat, doesn't it? Absolutely. All right. Am I going to use the green? I'm not going to use the green. You don't have to use the green. I love this orange. It's delightful, isn't it? Yeah, custom one you've made. I like it. I love when you do custom neons. They're fun. Very much so. All right. Look at this pesky fly. Doesn't it drive you nuts? <laughs> Gotta get in trouble in a minute. Mate, I'll tell ya. I was waiting for him. I was doing a painting earlier. And I thought, this little bugger is going to land in my paint in a minute. He got so close a few times. Did you catch him? Almost. All I need is a pair of chopsticks and go full on Mr Miyagi style. Now... One thing I have found mm. that I love doing, since you taught it to me, and I haven't used it for a while. Yeah. Especially with neons, I reckon this just <coughs> makes them pop. So, a little dot of... Selectivator. White. And then I'm going to grab my pink paint. And I'm going to fill him in. Sneaky. I remember you teaching me it ages ago and I thought, how come I haven't used that much? Because it's actually a really cool trick to get some really awesome looking cells. You know what works really nuts? Mm -hmm. I would tell you, but I'm going to keep secrets from now on. <laughs> Alright, so... And I think that's going to do that. Now I'm going to grab Georgia. Oh, Georgie. Thank <laughs> you. 
I like what you did there. Oh, pretty. And I'm gonna let that just sit. I'm gonna. Cause it's, it's gonna do its thing. So that's what I mean, them crazy looking cells. It's nuts, isn't it? Yeah. As I said, I don't know why I haven't used it for ages because it rocks. Really gives them tricky cell effects, doesn't it? Yeah. That a goober then? Could be. In my CA. How rude. I know. Alright. We're going to rock just that. Yeah. Two thirds of a traffic light. Yep. Well, you know. Loaded palette knife swipe. What's the amber one really mean? Go faster. You can go if you've got time. No, it's put your foot down. <laughs> That's where you're wrong. Yeah. Hope you didn't teach our son that. You did, didn't you? It's universally known, dude. <laughs> Red stop, greens go, orange, put you the boot this. into it. <laughs> you can make it. I'm actually one of the good people that stop. Do you? Yes. All right. That way. Number one. The <laughs> fly flew straight into my eyeball. Serious? Yeah. Did you survive? I did. I've got a close-up view of them, but I'm telling you. <laughs> you don't get much closer than that, do you? No. Alright. He's trying to give me butterfly kisses. <laughs> maybe he's giving us the hint that maybe we should do a fly one day. Ah. I don't think I've ever seen someone do a fly show. I think it's because they're so pesky when you're having a barbecue. Could be. You really don't want them hanging around, do you? No. Giving you food. And they don't taste good. <laughs> no. They're a bit crunchy. A bit crunchy? Yeah. It's worse when they go up your nose. <laughs> Alright. You know what's worse than finding a fly in your sandwich? No. Half a fly in your sandwich. <laughs> Is that a bad, <laughs> bad dad joke there? Yeah, you know you've eaten the other half. <laughs> that reminds me of this one time. I was in Sydney, right? I thought I was going to get a band camp then. Yeah, it was almost band camp. You thought about it? No, we went to this place, right, and I got a um, strawberry milkshake. Mm. And it was like yum, right? So you're sucking through the straw and it, <coughs> you go, man, they've got real chunks of strawberry in this. How cool is this? <laughs> and it wasn't, it was a fly. I'm glad that was you and not me. Yeah. Definitely glad. Just buzzing around, goes in my mouth. Well, that's like they were saying. How many people actually swallow spiders in their sleep? Lots. You do. I've watched them crawl in. Oh, get stood on. It's true. I don't think it is. I know it is. That's why your ears are always playing up. They've laid eggs in there. Well, they never used to. No, it's because all the spiders have come out. Could be worse. 
Could be me. <laughs> just didn't like that section, so I thought. Cover it up. That's pretty. That bloom center looks absolutely nuts, doesn't it? Yeah. That's what I thought. It'd um, float my boat. All right. I like it. That's pretty. Thank you, my love. You are more than welcome. Ooh, I like what you did there. <coughs> I notice you're rocking my colour palettes lately. Well, I sort of thought we get so caught up in... Blue. Yeah, and like my red and... I really love, like, the red and yellows and things. Yeah. It's my four o'clock alarm. Time to finish work. Now I'm on holiday again. <laughs> That's better. Now, where was I before I was rudely interrupted then? Um. Yes, yeah, so we completely lost it, didn't we? I really wasn't listening I've noticed We're being that honest. because if you were listening, you'd be able to go, Bubbles, you were about to ramble. It was about your colour palettes that you. Thank you. See, so, I sort of was listening. Chain of thought reactivated. Mm. So, I love my reds and yellow and oranges together and a bit, bit of gold or copper. Mm. So, I rock them a lot. And blue. Well, because you know blue. And Bubbles loves a blue. So, but, I thought, how much could you be missing out on? Because you're not sort of stepping out of your box. That's right. So, neons. I don't step out of my box. I fear change. So I actually embrace change really well. I like neons. <laughs> You love neon, so this is like your perfect palette today, isn't I it? I love it. Look at all that colour. It's like, woo, check it. They're actually really dazzling. Are they what? I'm sort of really digging them. I'm liking out of the box day. I'm sort of really digging this, dude. I know. It's like delightful. You know, I'm a spinner. Why not? Okay. Do you want me to move them colours for you? Well, I'll dump that first. Now I'll just move my paper towel I organised earlier. And then I can just scooch these over here. There we go. And then they're right there for when you're ready to grow them. <laughs> Man, that's pretty. Look at it. It's oh. opening up quite nice, isn't it? Look at that. Oh, look at it. Stoked. <coughs> that's gorgeous. <coughs> and that'll light up like a Christmas tree under a black light. And wipe our sides and our bottom. That's pretty. We'll just tidy them back up. <coughs> wow. Yeah, I think 
I might leave the rest alone because that's quite pretty. Isn't it? What? Hmm. That looks like an eye. Yeah. See it? Yeah, I do. Let's give it a little bit of feature there. Yeah, that's quite cool. I love it. I think we'll have to do a close-up reel of that one. Let's do that. You ready? Yeah. Okay. I like what you did there. Ooh, look what you did there. Yeah, we're going to leave it alone now. That's more than enough. That one doesn't equal that one, though, but that's got that little bit of a swirl there. Yeah, they're even. That eye's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. I'm pretty happy with that. I love it. Something well, different for Bubbles? Nice job, Bubbles. Thank you for letting me use your nails. You're welcome. I'm going to put my name on that one because that's awesome. Not a problem, my love. I love it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty happy with her. I think sometimes we all get that little bit nervous diving out of our normal box. But once you sort of get out of your comfort zone... Dive in. Have a fun play. It opens up the world to many other possibilities. Absolutely. So, I thank you for the inspiration today, my dear. No problem, Bob. Happy to help. Got me out of the box of um, my favourite palettes. I think we'll have to pause there now and see what you're going to bring to us. Okey dokey. You keep the light. <laughs> and we're back. And we, we are back. <laughs> Usually it's me kicking the lights so Oh, I know. I'm having a giggle as you're going... Can't you usually see that? <laughs> I'm just like, what? It's a win for bubbles. Why not? You may as well have one. Thank you, thank you. You are more than welcome. I have no one to thank but you. <laughs> I'm happy to oblige. <laughs> do, do, Don't you love do. a bright butterfly? I do love a bright flutterby. I'll give it that. I'm a butterfly fan. I just think they're beautiful. They are beautiful. And there's been some absolute... You know why I had to do it this week, butterflies? Because there's been so many beautiful ones around here lately. There has been, hasn't there? Yeah. Like that big one I had in work the other day. How beautiful was that? Mate, that was a stunner. Sad thing is, you know, that once they get that big and beautiful, they're nearly near the end of their lifespan. No! Mm-hmm. Really? <clears throat> yeah, well, the white ones are actually babies. And when they get um, their big, beautiful colours, they, they actually have a short lifespan. Shame, isn't it? Well, remind me never to come back as a butterfly. Yeah, no. Because you won't be here for long. No. thought you'd like a bit of useless information then. I love useless information. It's fun. <laughs> Usually it's you. I know. Go figure. Don't them colours pop on the black. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that's super cool. I didn't even think of trying to split base on this, and I really should have, because wow. Well. It's more like a mono butterfly colour. Mmm. It's good. Delightful. Yeah, that really is. I 
love that orange just in the center like that with a little touch of purple <laughs> Jagan? Yeah. That's from our wood dust clean up this morning. Mate, I'm telling you. Even with masks, you're still picking sawdust out of your nose. <laughs> yeah, MDF dust absolutely is a nightmare. And it builds up so quick when you make all your own stuff, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. But now we can see our concrete floor again. We can. Go it's, us. It's amazing. <laughs> he says. He <coughs> 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 me doing it. <coughs> I don't think I want to put the green in, you know. I wouldn't. Not with that centre. No. I think it'd really take the emphasis off that beautiful centre. The emphasis? Mm-hmm. Emphasis. I like that. Emphasis. Thank you. You are welcome. Sometimes I bring my brain to paint. Do you just? That doesn't happen often. We all know when we're painting, you're only using half of it. <laughs> and not the good half. <laughs> well, you actually are, because it's your creative side. The right side of the brain comes out when you paint. Yeah, it does. I'm watching the little pools of colour on the spinner as you're doing it, going, they are super cool. That's got a face. And everyone can see it. See? Smiley face. Even your drips running off are happy. It should be. I just love a paint day. A paint day is fun. It really is. You get out here and just chill after a big week. It's just nice, isn't it? Isn't it what? That's really pretty. That orange really stole the centre, didn't it? Yeah. It's really nice. It's orange. We love it. I actually really like orange. Me too. It's a happy colour. Then again, I just think neons radiate happiness. They, you've, they you've do for me. You've got me digging them. They do for me. I absolutely love new ones. I don't think I'm done playing with them yet. I thought it'd be one of them fads I have, where I sort of go, yeah, you know, had a turn. Yeah, I'll give it a go. You happy now? Yeah, it's like, yeah, I had a crack. Yeah, over it. But now that I've sort of seen <laughs> how much they pop, it's super cool. They really demand, did you, is that a bit of crap there? I think so. I seen that wiggle. Yeah, it was. You got it. Lucky you got it where you did in the middle of that scoop too, because it didn't ruin the um, swipe, did it? No. Sometimes you got to be tricky with them little bits of snot in your paint. <laughs> yep, drag it out. I remember the first time I got one, and you've gone, "Don't do that!" And I went, "Why not?" <laughs> and then I looked at the centre and went, "Oh no!" Oh dear. I really should listen sometimes. Some would think. Sometimes you just get carried away. All right. What I'll do is I'll start with that, give it a bit of a spin, spread it out a little bit. All right. Well. So I'll just move some of these paints so I don't... See your faces? Oh, well. I told you. So I was pointing them out to the camera because... <laughs> Hello. That is super cool. Yeah. I like it. Not that everyone else can see. No, they already did. There it is. Because I was pointing, going, see? Yeah, happy face. <laughs> All right. That's what I was saying. Even your drips are happy. See you later, happy face. Oh. He's not so happy now. Well, not that you got to it. Smile and politely till you scrapped it. Yeah, well, you know, it is what it is. Okay. Love those swipes. They're super cool. And that's the difference too, which is a good thing for people to see. Like when you do it the way I did it with the loader palette knives. 
can fade your colour out a bit too. Yes, it can. But when you do a swipe this way, it's just bold and true, isn't it? Look at that. You know, so I really wanted to keep that in the centre as much as possible. Yep. That's all we've found with <coughs> butterflies. If you bloom on them, if you put them on the wings, they will distort. Yes. But if you get it right in the centre, oh. Yeah, that's spread out. Really, 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 really pretty. That's perfect, that centre. Look at it. Tell me you're smiling politely. I usually do. Hey, you got orange pop through. See that? Yep. That's really cool. All right, so we give that a bit of a torch. Like so. We'll pop that back up. Have a bit more of a... With a skewer. <laughs> I don't know what you did with the other I one. I do. New, oh, yeah, I can see it. I can see it from where I'm looking. Right, so we'll go to the thinner skewer now. I love the thin skewer. And that just... Shish kebab. Yeah. As I said, really cool too. You get five for two bucks. And you just wipe them off. You do. But really good for fine detail stuff. I love it. You know what I am loving about them too? You can go back in after you've really spun it out. And you don't foculate the paint, do you? No. It's actually pretty good. And I think it is because it's such a fine sort of needle point tip. It is very, very fine. But also smooth and shiny. <laughs> Magpies like that. They do. This magpie loves them. I think it was one of my best ideas. I think you could be right. You know, the funny thing is I bought them like six months ago and they sat in my craft box thinking, why did I buy them again? <laughs> I knew we had some plan. <laughs> yeah. We had all these little plans and then went, hey, what did we do with them things? Oh, that's where we put them. Problem is you get sidetracked. <laughs> you do. Well, I do. I'm, I'm shocking for it. Few little drags here, few little drags there. I like that. It's pretty. You're right. I think that's done. Yeah, definitely. I'm gonna leave it at that. That's pretty. She's beautiful. Whoa, sexy. Yeah, she's beautiful. All right. That center's so gorgeous. We'll do a flyover of that one. Oh, look at it. Yeah, she's pretty. That's just lovely. Well, that was fun, wasn't it? I know. How much fun are they? And neons. Bright, happy day. I like bright and happy. That makes my day. It Absolutely. really does. Every time. That's why I'm addicted to neons. They are just lovely. Oh, they pack a punch. Yeah, these do. They're nuts. Very nice. All right, so that is us done for another week. It is. So, if you like that, hit like, share and subscribe. Bring the notification bell. Ding, ding. <laughs> that way you get to see all our videos as we release them. Absolutely. Okie dokie. Have fun. Take care. And, and we'll, we'll see, see you in the, the next one. one. Bye for now. Thanks for watching. Have a fantastic day, everyone.